Welcome to week seven, chapter seven. This week we're going to look at the human nature and organizational behavior. Basically, we can have all the systems we put, want in place. They can be automated and everything. But one of the things we got to deal with is the human nature. How does that affect what we're doing? How does it affect our security, our data prevention loss? Even how do we go about training employees? So that's what we're going to be looking at this week. How do we keep our system safe? How many people do we need looking at our system to ensure that we're going to have the safest system that we possibly can? So this week we're looking at human nature. And no matter who you are, you have your own. Every one of them is different. Everyone has their own set of, of rules that they go by. So one of the things we want to look at is social engineering. Social engineering is this wonderful thing that thieves have figured out. All they have to do is call someone, say they're with the IT department, and ask for information. Or they call someone, hey, I need help. I need to access this. I need someone who, you know, so-and-so gave me your name. As humans, we want to help, help. So we fall for that all the time. So that's what we're going to be looking at. How do we fight this? One of the ways that we're going to do it is we're going to train our employees. There has to be some real training that goes in, into what we tell them. we got to do it often. And there's different types of training we're going to look at. So there's a lot that's going on in this, week, uh, in this week about how do we do this. How do we deal with disgruntled employees? We know that they kill the morale of the corporation, but do we have to get rid of them? If so, how do we go about it? I know where we used where a couple jobs I worked at, you would be disconnected from the uh, network, your password, email, everything, if you were being fired, would be disconnected before you were even told. So it eliminates a lot of issues from that. So we're going to look at a whole bunch of different things. Ethics, you know, if you don't remember Enron, take a look at Enron fiasco and how top management was ethically corrupt and what they cost. But basically, we're looking at human behavior. How do we, how do we discourage people from creating crimes? Uh, there's a couple case studies. We'll go over more of that during our lecture. But so that's what we were looking at. So what do we have do this week? Well, this week we have our reading assignment, which is chapter seven. You're going to have your discussion question, your weekly paper, your quiz, and your assignments. In the lecture area, there's another video, uh, putting a human back into human resources. Again, you can watch this video. If you want to comment on it, it will count towards one of your replies to your classmates. It does not replace your reply, your initial reply. So you can watch the video and comment on that. So for week seven, if you look down in your assignment section, your discussion question, discuss how human nature affects access control. And as usual, your, your initial response is due Thursday at 11.59. And remember, you have to reply to at least two of your classmates. Your paper, that's how access control takes into the human nature. It's two to three pages. It is due Sunday night. You have a quiz for chapter seven, due Sunday night. And your journal entry, what did you learn this week, due Sunday night. So that is what is on tap for this week. Remember, if you have any questions, I check my email daily. Also, there's a student link question, student question links. So you can post it there. I do check that. And don't forget, what made you smile this week? Have a wonderful day.